everybody it's bob boob okay back to this goofy guy here this is bob boob hey i'm i'm doing a video tour here today this is a commercial property you can see here here's the building here it's 265 high street but what i'm actually looking at here this is thomas street right here so really your what would that be your west boundary line is 260 or we're at 265 high street yeah i know where i'm at um but uh this western boundary line is thomas street so right over here is the Thomas Street exit. Okay, that, that little bug there with the muffler, that's my mother leaving town, bye mom. Um, so right here is Route 220. So here, if we go zoom that way, you're gonna be uh, going towards Lock Haven, going west, go zoom that way, you're gonna be east going towards Williamsport. So really good location to a very busy exit right here then. Of course, you come in Thomas Street, and then some of you may be familiar um, Right down below us is the bank. Uh, down here is an insurance company. Uh, across the street is the Wise's grocery store. But this is a pretty pretty high traffic count area. But what we have here then is a large commercial building here. Again, the, the GPS address is 265 High Street. I'll show you some of the outside here uh, before we go inside. Back over here, there's another parking spot hidden over here. But this here, you get to see the outdoor unit. It's a... Um, what they call it, heat pump slash central air. That's a Gibson unit right there. Of course, you have another door right there. And here you have big parking area. Boy, guys, I guess depending how you would park in here, I would say that you could get eight to 10 cars easily, maybe more. I'm not sure exactly where the boundary line is here. I feel like here you could actually get some cars pushed over this way as well. And, uh, guess it depends too you driving some beast of a truck or a small little super cool red jeep like me you can get more of those in the parking lot so let me think here i guess that's on the outside there so between lock haven between Weemsport, definitely a good spot for a, a business location so then as we walk in you see here's the entrance way uh the building was built on a crawl space that there's no basement um, it's block foundation, vented very well. And I remember earlier showing you that side door, but just a big, huge, open, like bullpen sort of an area where you could set lots of desks or chairs. Again, trying to think out of the box a little bit, not knowing what business might want to be in here, but you've got lots of space. Then you have one, two, three office areas. You can see. It's kind of, I guess, the reception area where you could shut that and have it as a private office. Another private office here. And then this can be an office or just used as a kitchenette. This is a larger room here, as you can see. Lots of cabinets here, a little sink area. So that's nice size. And again here, just trying to give you a different look here. Of course here, this is the southern view. So uh, east to west here, you get lots of sunshine coming in here. I turned the lights on for the video, but honestly, you probably won't need them on. Save on the power. And then here you have a first floor bathroom. This is all handicap accessible with the wide doors and plenty of room in the bars and that sort of thing. Um, though I'm finding in my 50s, I like having the bars there. Sometimes my leg falls asleep. I know, it's TMI. Um, but you have that. Let me show you here. Oh, yeah, here's the electric big 200 amp see that 200 200 zero, zero. so we've got a big 200 amp electrical service and here we do the big circle where voila remember where we were parked at there and here's the back of the bank right there so yeah so let me take you upstairs and show you around because a little bit of an optical illusion here because uh place is bigger than what you think it's going to be so you got all that space there now, under, that's the steps over here. I'm going to take you up in just a second to go to the second floor. But this is some nice storage area here. My suspicion is, yeah, looks like right there is a trap door to go down in the crawl space area. But since Bobby Booby's afraid of bugs and spiders, we're not going down there. But if you want to go down here, you're welcome to. So then we come upstairs. Now, this is really ginormous. Ginormous is a professional real estate term. But look at the size of this place. This is huge. You could have a archery range here or a shooting range here. This thing, I mean, just kidding, you really shouldn't be shooting in town. But uh, 
Isn't this big? So again, more office area, storage area. Again, not knowing what the type of business you have or the nature. I suspect that these little square doors, uh, rectangle doors are not hobbit holes, but they are for accessing some of that storage, what they would call the knee walls right here and behind there then. And then there you get to see the air handler here. Again, Gibson, so new windows. Gosh, guys, it's it's just a neat newer place. If you have a business that could benefit from a high traffic count location next to a major road like 220, and you think Jersey Shore PA would be a good spot for it, I'd encourage you to reach out to your realtor and have them show it to you or get a hold of me, Bobby Booby. Again, beautiful, beautiful location here. Sure, isn't it? Okay, that's it. Thank you guys for watching the video tour. Hope you had a good day. Have a good day. Bye-bye.